Okay, it's now that time of year that you've got to get your uh, CPD record into IFL, so I'm going to show you how to add things to that CPD record um, in case you've not done it before. Uh, I'm going to log into IFL first of all. Okay, so down the bottom left corner here, I want to launch Reflect. Okay, so this is the front page of Reflect that you've got here. And it says here I've got six asset in my six assets in my asset store, so I'll show you those. And what we've got is my CPD record, and then I've got five different CPD events that I've got there already. If you didn't have a CPD record set up, you can go to create new CPD record, and you create one there. Okay. Now let's say I want to add something into that CPD record. Now back in September I went on a course about PHP through NetSkills. So I'm going to put something in about that. So I'm going to go to create new activity and I just put a title in here. So it's PHP primed and ready NetSkills. Let's put a description in. Okay, and we can give it a tag. So I'm just going to give it the tag of CPD. And we click on the arrow to go to the next page. Okay, so the reasons for undertaking this activity. So you see with each one here, I can click on the the actual line. So there's reasons for undertaking the activity. So I've put something in there. So I then click on the knowledge and skills gained, and it moves up like that. That tells you there. Okay. And then here we put in our start and finish date. So we're going to say it was the 16th of September. And it finished on the 16th of September. Okay. How do we put a bit of reflection in about this? Okay, and then we put our time spent on this activity. So this is an all day, so I'm going to say seven hours on that. Okay, and if you want a reminder for you to reflect on this activity, you can put that in there as well. And I'll say it arose from my CPD plan. Okay, so you've completed the form, so that's me set up the activity, but I've not linked it to my CPD record yet. So this is how I do this I go to send to and CPD record. And then it'll list all the different CPD records you may have set up, but I've only set up the one, and that's my main CPD record. So I can click that and say OK. OK, so this is now my CPD record for the year. And so we can scroll down and say that the record targets 30 hours, done 46. And so that's me done the, rec the, the required 30 hours from IFL. So when you come to actually upload um, your CPD record to Reflect, you'll go to Tools and there'll be an extra one in there that'll say CPD Decl Declaration. And you select that and follow the steps through there and that will send the CPD record that we've shown there through to IFL.